so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout Mika! Hey everyone, it's me Mika, and today I'm at Sky Zone Trampoline Park in Anaheim, California. <laughs> Ooh, look at these blocks! They're so fun and light. They're made out of foam. And look, this one is orange. And oh, there's a blue one there too. And it says, welcome. <laughs> That's so nice. I'm really excited because there are trampolines here and foam pits that you can jump into. And I really want to learn how to do a flip. I wonder if there's someone here who can teach me how to do that. Let's go find out. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, I'm Priscilla, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Welcome to Sky Zone. Ooh, thank you, I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> awesome, okay, first we do need to pick out some wristbands in order to go inside the park. Ooh, I love wristbands. Hmm. So which color would you like? Oh, let's see, there's orange, green, <gasps> yellow. Yellow's one of my favorite colors. I Mine want too, all right, here, let's go. Thank you, so official. <laughs> and now we have to pick out some socks. Okay, why do we need to put on special socks? The special socks have grip on them so that when you're on the trampoline, you don't slip. Oh, that's so smart. Hmm, let's see, we have some orange socks and ooh, some blue and black and pink socks. Hmm, I think I'm gonna go with the orange. I love this color, and my best friend Flippy really loves orange. I'm gonna wear these. All right, perfect. <laughs> Thank so you. What brings you in today? Oh, I really want to learn how to do a flip on the trampoline. All right, perfect. We have Quincy in the park who can teach you how to do a flip. Wow. Okay, let's go find Quincy. Thank you. Of course. <laughs> trampolines and this huge foam pit behind me. Wow, I've never seen so many trampolines before. Will you count them with me? Awesome, let's go. Okay, ready? One, <laughs> two, three, four, five. Wow, five trampolines! Huh, I wonder where Quincy is. That's who's supposed to teach me how to do a flip. Oh, I'm so excited. Where is he though? I wonder if he's in the foam pit. Should I jump in and see? <laughs> Let's do it. Woo, wow. <laughs> Quincy. Quincy? Hmm. Quincy! I don't think anyone's in here, except me. <laughs> Whoa, it says foam zone. That's where we are in this big foam zone. Check out these blocks. Look, you see a square? When there's six squares together, that makes a cube. And these are made out of foam, so it's soft and squishy, so it feels really fun and nice to jump into a foam pit. And you don't get hurt. <laughs> Look, there's orange, blue, and black. <laughs> this is so fun. I can't wait till I learn how to do a flip. I wonder where Quincy is. <gasps> Maybe he's over there. Come on, let's go look. Whoa, this is cool. But I still don't see Quincy anywhere, huh? Whoa, I know what this is. It's orange, it's round, and oh, it bounces. This is a basketball. But why would a basketball be at a trampoline park? Hey. There's a basketball hoop <laughs> and another trampoline. I bet jumping on a trampoline and throwing a basketball into the hoop is a lot easier than if you're just on a regular ground. Oh, 
I'm gonna try it. Okay, let's see. On three. One, two, three. Ah, didn't get it in. Oh, here's another one. It's yellow. Maybe I'll try and throw it backwards. One, two, three. Whoa. Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> oh, there's another one. Hmm. Maybe if I do three big bounces to the hoop, that will go in. Ready? One, two, three. Ah, there's one more ball. Okay, how should I do this one? Hmm, maybe I'll do one giant bounce and a turn for finesse. <laughs> Ready? One. I still didn't get it in. <laughs> That's okay. I'm gonna keep looking for Quincy. I can't wait to learn how to do a flip. <sighs> Quincy! No, Quincy. <laughs> Let's go over to the other side. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> do you know what this is? This is a balance beam. It's called that because it's a beam and you have to have really good balance to stand on it. Whew. You don't want to wobble and go side to side. Did you know that there are a lot of animals who have really good balance? And mostly because of their tails. <laughs> Squirrels have really good balance because of their swooshy tails and cats, meow. Meow. <laughs> and kangaroos. Yeah, kangaroos have long tails that help them balance and they're really good jumpers. <laughs> Will you jump with me? <laughs> hey, let's jump over there. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, more trampolines. Look how many are in here. Whoa! Wow! That has to be Quincy! He's so good at jumping! Whoa! Whoa! Wow! Are you Hello? Quincy? I am Quincy. Hi, I'm Mika! It's nice to meet you, Mika. How nice you doing? You too. I'm having so much fun here. I'm so glad to hear that, Mika. So I heard that you are really good at flipping. You might have heard right. Oh, well, I want to learn how to flip too. Can you help me? I can take good care of you. Awesome. What do we need to do first? All right, first and foremost, we have to warm up. Oh, right. It's important to warm up our body so we don't get hurt. Exactly, Mika. Okay, so what do we need to do? So first things first, you know, we're just going to touch the ground. Oh, okay. We're just touch, touch the, the ground. ground. Oh. You know, then we're going to lean to the left. And then we're going to lean it to the right. Okay. Ah. And you know, once your legs feel all good, you get some jumping jacks in. Woo! You know, you know, have some fun with it. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Wow, it's kind of like making a snow angel in the air. Exactly. Whoa! <laughs> wow! Okay, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm getting warmer and looser. Are <laughs> right, you feeling warm and loose? I think so. All right, let's see if you can do a jump twist then. Jump to us. Okay, ready? Ooh, like okay. that? Just like that. Wow. <laughs> I got what else can we do? Well, you ever done a somersault? Yeah, have you ever done a somersault before? Okay, let's do it together. All right, you know how to do a somersault, Mika? Yeah, so what are the first steps, just first as a steps, reminder? Visualize your platform. Ooh, okay, visualize. Then you're gonna put your hands out. Okay. Oh. And fall. Okay, so hands out, and what do I do with my head? You're gonna tuck your head in like a bowling ball. Oh, tuck your head in like a bowling ball. You're gonna tuck and roll. And then become the ball. Become the ball. <laughs> Here I go. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that, Mika. That was so fun. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Okay, ready? All right. Visualize. Visualize. Head tucked. Head tucked. And become the ball. Become the ball. Whoa, that was really fun. It was really fun. Now I got a question for you. Yeah. 
Think you can do it in the air? Oh, I've never tried before. You want me to show you? Yes, please. All right. But first, you're gonna get a whole lot of air. Whoa. A whole lot of air. And then, next you're gonna do, you tuck your chin again. So once you get all that air, you're gonna tuck your chin. And remember, only try and do a flip if you're with a grown-up. Whoa, did you see that? He just did a front flip in the air. That was amazing. <laughs> ah, thank you. How do you jump that high? Uh, <sighs> basketball helps. Whoa. Whoa. Sometimes, he's gotta have fun with it in the air. Hop over your leg. Wow, you're so good Meditate at jumping. Bit. Whoa. <laughs> Wow, that was so fun. But Quincy, I don't know if I'm ready to do a flip in the air like you just did. Well, you gotta keep practicing, Mika, and then you'll get it. I got it. So, I have to remember to jump really high, stay in one spot, tuck my head, and go forward like a ball. Exactly, it's just like a somersault, but you're taking away the ground. Got it. Thank you so much. Of course, Mika. I'm gonna take all of these things and I'm gonna practice and then one day I'll get to do a front flip just like you, Quincy. I hope so, Mika. <laughs> Thank you so much. Of course, I'm gonna go bounce now. All right, me too. See you later. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> wow, that was so much fun playing and bouncing at Sky Zone Trampoline Park. <laughs> I really wanted to learn how to do a flip today, and Quincy was an amazing teacher. He knows a lot about flipping and bouncing on trampolines. Oh, and it was so fun jumping into the foam pit. The foam pit was nice and soft and squishy and oh, made out of blocks like this. Wait a second. Do you know what this says? It says, Mika. <laughs> That's me, that's my name. Well, I had so much fun playing and learning with you today. If you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Awesome! M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. We'll see you next time, bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And I'm so excited because today we get to meet someone very special, Sean Johnson. <laughs> John is an Olympic gold medal gymnast. Gymnastics is a cool sport where you get to do lots of fun things with your body. It takes a lot of practice, strength, flexibility. <laughs> and Sean is going to show us some cool moves at the Nashville Gymnastics Training Center. I can't hardly wait. Woohoo! Here we go. Woo! <gasps> oh, hi. <laughs> hey, Sean. I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. It's so great to meet you. <laughs> you too. <laughs> Will you show us some gymnastics? I would love to, but first we need to stretch and warm up to stay safe. Oh, right, because yes. first things first, safety first. Yes. So let's stretch your arms first, just kind All of right. across. Arms first. Yes. <laughs> How old were you when you started doing gymnastics? I actually started gymnastics when I was two years old. Whoa. I came into the gym and I just got to run around and I loved it. Oh, that sounds so yes. fun. Yes, it's kind <laughs> of like a playground. Mm -hmm. But it's really soft and cushy, so you can do a lot of flips and stuff and stay safe. Oh, that's so yes. important. Let's stretch our legs next, right okay, here. Sean. So grab the back. It takes some balance, though. So. Whoa, you're really good at balancing. Yes. How a lot of practice. Yes, how often did you practice? So when I started at the age of two, I only went for like one hour, one time a week. But as I got older and I got better at it, I kind of went more and more hours. Wow. Because um, it takes a lot of practice to go to the Olympics. It really does. Yes. Yeah. And how many Olympic medals do you have? I have four Olympic medals. Oh. I have a gold on the balance beam, and I have a silver on the floor, and on the team, and on the all around. Whoa. <laughs> yes. What are the differences between the medal colors? Yes. So. The gold is number one. It's like the first place. And silver <laughs> is number two, second place. Nice. Yes. And then there's another one too, right? There's a bronze, which is third place. And did you ever lose? I did, a lot. 
I lost a lot of competitions, but I actually liked it better. Whenever I would make mistakes, it was so rewarding to come back into the gym and work on it and get better and like feel good inside. Oh, yes. Yeah. It's okay if you make mistakes. It's just an opportunity for growth. Yes. Okay, so let's sit down a little bit and stretch a little bit more before we get started. Okay. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Oh, it's okay to be nervous. I get nervous a lot. You do? Yes. What do you do when you get nervous? I practice so that I feel more confident. I trust myself and I say, I can do this. Mm. And I ask my coach if I'm ready. I can do this. Yes. <laughs> now lean forward a little bit. Put your feet out in front of you. And touch your toes. Touch those toes. <laughs> I do think we're ready to get started. Oh, yay. Are you excited? I'm so excited. Okay, let's go do it. Here we go. <laughs> Can you teach me something on the beam? I can, but first we're gonna start on the low beam and progressively work our way here. Great idea. Okay. Progressively okay. means we take it one step at a time. Yes. Until you feel comfortable and much better. So we're gonna start at this end of the beam. Okay. <laughs> and you're gonna step up here. Okay, here I go. So the key to gymnastics is keeping all of your muscles squeezed as tight as possible. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. That helps us not fall off the beam. Right. If you do fall off the beam, it's okay. We'll right. just get back up and try again. Do you ever fall? I fall a lot. But with practice, you get more confident and better at your skills, so you fall less. Right. Okay, so arms will go straight out to the side. Nope. You can, I think you got this one. Oh, thanks. Okay. You're gonna kind of look right down at the beam to mm -hmm. make sure you walk in a straight line. Okay. And we're just gonna walk forward. Okay. Walk one, two, two, three, three, four, four. Okay, nice. now we're gonna walk backwards. Oh, that sounds tricky. So the thing with this is you're gonna feel for the beam and then plant your foot. Make sure you look down. Feel for the beam, for the plant. Beam. And you're gonna go back till you feel the end of the beam. Okay. And when you feel the end, you're gonna stop. Okay. Keep going, <laughs> keep feeling. Keep feeling. <gasps> there you are. Yay, I made it to the stop. end. <laughs> so now we're gonna do flamingo walk. Okay. You're flamingo. gonna take a step. Hmm. Flamingo. Flamingo. Step. Flamingo. Ska, ska. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there flamingo. we go. Step. Flamingo. Step. Flamingo. Now in gymnastics, we yes. always like to be barefoot uh -huh. because being able to feel the beam with our bare feet helps us have more control. It's Probably safer. Probably makes it less slippery too. Yes. So one more. Flamingo. Good job. <laughs> okay, next skill, we're gonna try a scale. Uh-huh. I don't know why they call it this, but it's just the name. You're gonna take your dominant side, which is usually the same side of your body you write with. My right hand side. Yes, and for some reason, I think one side of your body is just usually stronger. So we Ooh. favor that in gymnastics. Okay. So you take your dominant side, mm -hmm. lean forward, arms out, and scale down. Whoa! And scale back up. Scale down. <gasps> and scale back up. Good job! <laughs> that takes a lot of strength and a lot of balance. Mm -hmm. Okay, last one, are you ready? I'm ready. So with this one, we're actually gonna do a jump. <gasps> Whoa. Now, for all the kids watching, make sure you always have a coach with you and you don't do anything your coach doesn't say is safe for you. Okay. Okay. Is but it I safe, think you're Sean? ready. I think you're ready okay. for this. Coach says we're ready. <laughs> so when you jump, you want to squeeze all your muscles super tight. You're going to go down, jump, down. So okay. bend, straight, bend. And squeeze all those muscles together. Okay. Make sure you look at the beam too. There we go. Ready? Here we go. Whoa. It's okay. We can try it again. Count to 10 and try again. Will you count to 10 with us? Oh, great. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And try again. Okay, here we go. Remember, squeeze your muscles, mm -hmm. squeeze all everything together. And I think you got this one by yourself. Are you ready? Okay. Make sure you look at the beam. Ready, one, two, two three. three. Good job! Yeah. 
<laughs> okay, I think you're ready for the big beam. <gasps> okay, let's try the big beam. Let's go. So with the big beam, I personally think the hardest part is just climbing up. So I'll help you climb up and then I can hold your hand through the whole thing. Okay, it's really tall. I know. But it might feel tall, but nothing's changed. It's the same beam as down there. Mm -hmm. And you are so confident and strong, I know you can do it up here. Thanks, Dad. Let's do it. <laughs> this is tricky. Whoa! Does it feel a little higher? Yeah, I feel a little nervous. Okay, remember, tell yourself, I can do this. Take a deep breath and know that your coach, myself, <laughs> believes you can do it too. I can do this. <sighs> deep breaths. And make sure if you're at home, you don't try any of this without a coach or without a gym, because safety is definitely first. Mm -hmm. Most Good important. Job. Okay, you've kind of mastered the forward walking. Let's try the backward. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Look at the beam. Squeeze all your muscles. Build feel your foot. behind you and plant your foot. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Let's take two more steps. Okay. One. One. <gasps> two. Okay. Are you ready for your flamingos? Yes. Okay. Let's try four this time. Four flamingos. Yeah. Here we go. One. Two. Three, four, flamingos. Good job. Spot, spot, hey, spot. <laughs> are you ready for your jump? I'm ready. Okay, so Whoa. here, I'm actually gonna get on the beam with you and okay. help you with your jump. So, what we're gonna do, I'll show you, you feel my hands. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do a small jump, keep every muscle really tight, just like that. I'm gonna hold your hands, you use me for balance. You're gonna squeeze everything together, go down, jump, down, and you're good. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Okay, make sure you look at the beam. Ready? One, mm -hmm. two, three. Whoa! Good job! <laughs> that was really good. That okay. was fun. You wanna try one more? Yeah. Okay, ready? One, two, three. <gasps> good job! Whoa! I'm so proud of you. Oh, I think you've so. mastered the beam. Do you wanna go to the floor? Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that beam was so fun! I was so proud of you. You did such a good job. Oh, thank you, Sean. <laughs> and the medal goes to... <gasps> Mika! <laughs> so, now that we're on the floor, I thought I could teach you another new skill. Oh, great! But first, can you do a cartwheel? Oh, yes. I love doing cartwheels. Do you mind showing me your cartwheel? I'd be happy to. Okay, let's see it. <laughs> That's a really good cartwheel. Oh, thank Since you, you already know how to do a cartwheel, mm -hmm. how about we take the next step and we learn a round off? Sounds great, a okay. round off? A round off is like a cartwheel, but instead of landing one foot at a time, you put your feet together. Whoa. Yeah, it's a foundational skill in gymnastics that you learn before you learn all the big flips, like flips and tricks. Oh, yes, yeah. that sounds great. Okay, so I'll show you first. Uh huh. The cartwheel, just like you did, is pretty simple like this. Mm -hmm. One foot after another. So what you're going to do is, when you're upside down, your uh -huh. feet will come together and land together. Kind of like this. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> and this might sound silly, but the floor, you want to push it away as hard as you can. Okay. That's what kind of gives you that speed to kind of jump off the floor. All right. Okay, are you ready to try one? Sure. Let's I'll give, give it, it a, a shot. It's okay if we make mistakes. We'll work on it. That's true. That's what I learned on the beam. Yes. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, here I go. Whoa. <laughs> Good job. Good job. So we also want to try to keep our legs as straight as we can. Okay. And a little trick for that is if you point your toes as hard as you can, your legs will naturally straighten. Really? Yeah. Okay, let's try one more time. Sure. That was a lot better. Oh, Yay! Good. I'm so proud of you again. That's another <laughs> new skill. Thank you so much, Sean. Of course. That was awesome. Good job. <laughs> <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> that was so cool. Thank you. Do 
you think I could do that someday? I think with a lot of practice and hard work, you definitely could. Oh, thank you for showing me all those skills. You did such a good job on the beam, on the floor. I was really proud of you. Oh, yeah. We had such a busy day today. We learned how to do <gasps> balancing walks on the beam and scales. Wow. <laughs> and we learned how to do a round off at the end of our cartwheels. Yeah. Oh, we also learned that there's a side of your body that's usually stronger than the other side. Yeah, and that's the side we usually use in gymnastics. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Can you spell my name with me? S H A. W-N, Sean! <laughs> Bye, friends! Oh, I'd like to keep practicing, please. Me too. <laughs>
Will you count the sides with me? Okay. One, two, three, four, five. A pentagon has five sides. And this shape is a hexagon. <laughs> Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six sides. So in soccer, you want to get the ball into the goal, but you can't use your hands. You can use your feet, you can use your knees. Hmm, wait a second. There's more balls over here. I wonder if I can get all of them into the goal. Let's see. Oh, we saw something like this earlier. It's a tiny basketball. Do you know what color it is? That's right, it's orange. I'm gonna kick it in the goal. Here we go. Boop. <laughs> oh yeah, goal. And what? <laughs> this tiny one looks like a ball pit ball. Do you know what color that is? Yellow, <laughs> one of my favorites. Let's see if I can kick this tiny little ball into the goal. <gasps> Boop, yes, goal. And we have this really bouncy ball and it's blue. All right, in you go. Yeah, whoa, that was a big one. Goal. And another basketball, but this one's a different color. Do you know what color it is? Red, oh right. That was too light of a kick, but don't worry, I have it in me. Here we go. Goal, see, I knew I could do it. And here's another really bouncy ball, and it's yellow. All right. Three, two, one. Goal! Do you know what this color is? Oh yeah, it's red. Okay. Goal! <laughs> and now is the time for the official soccer kick. I'm using a soccer ball. I'm using a soccer goal. One. for playing with me. wonder what else is here to play with. Let's go. Hey, look at these colorful blocks. Huh. They're kind of set up like bowling pins. And bowling is another sport where you use a ball. There's usually 10 pins for bowling. Will you count with me? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is the perfect setup for bowling. The pins don't usually look like this. These are rectangles. Do you know what a rectangle is? It's a shape with four sides and it has two long sides and two short sides. Let's count them. One, two, three, four. Yeah. That's a rectangle. Hmm, and usually you have a bowling ball, which is really heavy. <laughs> but I don't think there's any bowling balls here. Hey, but there's some balls over here. I wonder what kind of ball would knock these blocks over? Hmm, we could try, oh, <laughs> look at this little one. Do you know what color this is? Blue, yeah, let's see if it will knock over these blocks. Nope. <laughs> what about this one? This is a fun yellow ball. All right, let's see if this one will work. Whoa! <laughs> wow, that's a really bouncy ball. It bounced right off the pin. Let's see how many I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hey, that's pretty good. I'll set them back up. We can try another ball. Awesome. Ooh, what about this basketball? I wonder if it's too bouncy to knock any of these blocks over. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yep, I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> 
We have one ball left to try. The soccer ball. Let's see if the soccer ball can knock any blocks over. Okay. Here we go. Three, two, one. Wow, I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks. Hmm, I wonder what else we could do to knock these blocks down. I have an idea. What if instead of bowling, we played Mika Bowl? <laughs> And instead of using a ball, I'll use me. <laughs> okay, set these up, and I'm gonna find a way to go down and knock these blocks over. What can I do? I can dance, I can crawl, I can run, or I can be one of my favorite dinosaurs, a T-Rex. Are you ready for the Mika Bowl? Rawr. Yeah, I did it! I knocked all the pins over, and in bowling when that happens, it's called a strike! Strike! Five, six, seven, eight, and now it's time to celebrate! Come on, let's keep playing! Whoa, there are a lot of shapes here. <gasps> Come look at this one. This is an octagon. Do you know how many sides it has? Well, let's count and find out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight sides. Wow, that's a really cool shape. Hmm. Look at these little chairs. If you look at the back of them, you can see a square. A square has four sides, see? One, two, three, four. And there's one, two, three, four squares. But if you look even closer, when all of them are together, it makes one big rectangle. And, Makes for a really comfy couch. <laughs> Whoa, do you see this? It's a giant circle. Huh, it kind of looks like a cake or a pie. Whoa, look at this big slice of cake. Mmm, mmm, mm -hmm. very tasty. <laughs> wow, there's more shapes over here. I see a big, purple rectangle. See, there's the two long sides and the two short sides. <laughs> oh, and if you look to the side here, I see a pink triangle. See, one, two, three. Do you see any other shapes? <gasps> yeah, a circle, a red circle. <laughs> and this ball is here too. Should I throw the ball through the circle? Okay, let's do it. All right, ready? So long, ball! Woo! <laughs> hey, I see some really special circles over there. Come on! Whoa! Look at all of these bubbles. These are the cool circles that I was talking about. <laughs> bubbles are so fun. Hey, you know what I just realized? Every ball we played with today was a circle. A basketball, a soccer ball, a bouncy ball, a ball pit ball. <laughs> so many circles today. Can you remember any other shapes that we saw? We saw a hexagon, a pentagon, an octagon, a rectangle, a triangle, a square. <sighs> there are so many shapes all around us all the time. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. 
Mika. <laughs> well, I'm gonna keep playing with these bubbles. See you next time. Bye. This place is so awesome because you get to move your body and have a lot of fun and we get to play a game today. Come on! Whoa! This place is amazing! It's slide time! Meet you at the bottom. And I landed in a ball pit! Whoa! Ball pits are so fun! Ooh, and I like all of these colors. Let's see. <gasps> Pink. <laughs> and there's blue. And white. There's so much you can do in a ball pit. You can dance. You could juggle. Whoa, I only know how to juggle two balls. I don't know how to do three yet. I have to keep practicing. <laughs> hey, look over here. Whoa, at the very top, it looks like a big scoop of ice cream or maybe a marshmallow or something. Oh, and there's a cool looking pattern on it. White, blue, white, blue, white, blue, white, blue, all the way around. Oh, I like that. Ooh, let's go inside. Ooh. Hello. <laughs> oh, this is a fun little space. Hmm. Whoa, look at this. This ball has words on it. Oh, let's read it. Go to the slide for an item to catch and find the play area that looks like it's match. A match, that means that it looks the same. Hmm. Hey, looks like we get to exercise our bodies and our minds. <laughs> this is gonna be a really good game for the mind. Hmm, go to the slide. There must be another slide here. Let's go find it. Oh, this has to be the other slide. I wonder what's gonna happen here that will help me play the game. <gasps> Look. Whoa, have you seen this before? It's a stethoscope. Maybe you've seen one at the doctor's office? Yeah, a doctor will use this to listen to your heartbeat. Oh yeah, nice and healthy. <laughs> I wonder if there's a doctor center around here. Let's go find out. Hmm, I wonder where this stethoscope goes. Oh, look at this cool thing. Oh, hello. Oh, let's look up here. Hmm. I don't think this is where our stethoscope belongs. <laughs> it's really fun though. Whoa. Hmm. <gasps> hey, look, mini clinic. We found it. This is a doctor's office. The stethoscope definitely belongs there. Come on. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, hello, welcome. Do you have an appointment? You're, oh, yep, you're right there. Come on in. <laughs> Doctors and nurses are so cool and very important. They take care of us and make sure we're feeling nice and healthy. They check your heartbeat, see what kind of tools are in here. Ooh, they'll probably look at your eyes and look inside your ears. <laughs> and sometimes they have you stick your tongue out and say, ah. Ooh, and look, there's some glasses. Ooh, one of my favorite colors too, yellow. And look, you can dress up like a doctor. So official. And a little hat. Oh, how do I look? Dr. Mika. <laughs> okay, so this is definitely where the stethoscope goes. Okay, let's just clean up and go back to the slide. Come on. I'm so excited to see what the next item is. <gasps> Here it comes. Whoa. <gasps> Do you know what this is? It's a tomato. Ooh, one of my favorites. Yum. <laughs> hmm, I wonder if there's a grocery store or something here. 
Let's go look! Whoa! A carousel! Oh, look at this nice orange one! Let's get on. Oh, hello, horsey! I'm Mika! Hmm, I wonder how this thing works. That's not it. Oh, that's it! <laughs> Whoa, this is fun! Hey, what a cool way to look for a space where the tomato belongs. Hmm, let me know if you see something. <gasps> right there! A supermarket! This is definitely where the tomato belongs. Hey, look down here. More food. Yeah, a supermarket or a grocery store is where you can buy food, like a tomato. Hmm, what are some other red foods? <gasps> Ooh, what about this red pepper? Yummy. Hmm. Oh, here's another red pepper. And, oh, I love this red food. Strawberries. <laughs> I'm gonna have a red meal. Hmm. Ooh, more strawberries. And an apple. Okay, now I have all of my food. I have to pay for it. Let's go inside. <laughs> Come on. Do, 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 do. Okay. Oh. All right, let's see. Oh, I guess I can ring up my own items. Hmm. All right, bell pepper. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, interesting. <laughs> strawberries. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> okay. More strawberries. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, now we're cooking. Pepper. Beep, beep, beep. Ooh. Apple. Beep, beep, beep. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And tomato. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, yeah. Now we're grooving. How am I gonna pay for this food? I don't know, but I'm in a good mood. <laughs> oh, it looks like I have a credit card here. Let's see, my grand total is six dollars. Okay, let's see. Okay, that worked. All right, don't need any change. I think I'm done here. <laughs> okay, so the tomato is with the food. Good job matching with me. Hey, let's go back to the slide and see what else comes down. Come on. Oh, I'm having so much fun. I wonder what the next item will be. Whoa, look at this. A firefighter helmet. Yeah, firefighters will wear a helmet like this to protect their heads when they're fighting fires. Huh, I wonder what kind of area would have a firefighter helmet. <laughs> let's go find out. Whoa, did you find where the firefighter helmet belongs? <laughs> Good job, looks like a match. See, there's a fire truck and firefighters drive fire trucks to where the fire is to put it out and save the day. <laughs> this is a really cool truck. Oh, see the big ladder and, <gasps> ooh, a walkie talkie. <laughs> firefighter Mika here, over. <laughs> Yes, that is correct. Everything is fine here. Yes, have a good day. Okay, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And look, here's where the siren is so people know that a fire truck is on the way. It sounds like Something like that. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'll put this firefighter helmet here. That way, if someone wants to play, they can be the driver and wear the firefighter helmet and look like a real firefighter. <laughs> Let's go back to the slide and see what the next item is. Come on. Yes, so far so good. And I think there's another item about to come down. <gasps> Whoa, oh, that was fast. Ooh, what is this, Gouda? <laughs> That's kind of cheese, one of my favorites. <laughs> oh, do you know what letter that is? It's the first letter of the alphabet. <laughs> That's right, the letter A. Hmm, I wonder if there are more letters around here. Let's go look. Okay, I have the letter A. I wonder if there are any other letters around. Hmm. Oh, I see letters in there. Let's go inside. <gasps> Whoa, it's a trampoline. <laughs> All right, 
let's see. I have the letter A, and there's B, C, D. This is definitely where the letter A goes. Hey, I know what we could do. We could think of an animal that begins with the letter A, and then we could act it out. <laughs> hmm. I have one. Ant eater. <laughs> Can you act like an ant eater? They do, in fact, eat ants. They have really long nose and mouth, and they go around and they look for ants. Any ants over here? Nom, 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 nom. Any ants over here? Nom, 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 nom. Hey, give me that ant back. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> oh, and the next letter, the letter B. Ooh, I know one. A bat. Let's act like bats together. Bats begin with the letter B. Spread your wings and fly like a bat. Or jump. Whoa. Kind of feels like I'm flying for real. <laughs> and the letter C. Cat begins with the letter C. Hmm. How can we act like cat? Get your little paws out and meow, 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 meow. Whoa, calm down, cat. Calm down, cat. What about the letter D? The animal starts with the letter D. <gasps> dog! Can you act like a dog with me? Okay. <laughs> Good job! Now you can just jump and bounce and have, whoa, fun! <laughs> hey! Bounce begins with the letter B. <laughs> Let's go back to the slide and see if there are any more items. Come on. Whoa, these slides are so cool. I wonder if anything else will slide down. <gasps> oh, look, it's one of the ball pit balls. I wonder if we need to go to the other ball pit. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> oh yeah, we definitely need to go to the other ball pit. Let's go. Okay, let's go find that ball pit. Come on. Whoa, a big white slide. Oh, I have to go down. Ready? Three, two, one. Woo! Whoa, that was so fast. Do you see the ball pit? It's behind me. Whoa, let's find a fun way to get into it. Hello. Whoa! Look at this. It's a big slide. All right, I'm going down. See you at the bottom. Whoa! <laughs> I love that there are two ball pits in this indoor playground. Whoa! Oh, we just swim on over. <laughs> Whoa! This is so fun. This is definitely where the white ball belongs. There you go. <laughs> hey, look at this wall. See the two colors? Pink and blue? And it makes a pattern, see? Pink, blue. Pink, blue. Do you know what the next color is? <laughs> That's right, pink. Hey, look at that little car. It's so cute. And there's three more ball pit balls. There's a pink one, and a white one, and a blue one. And there's words on this one. Let's see. You've finished the game, now count all you've done, then go down the slide for some extra fun. Whoa, that means we finished the game. We did it, we did it, we really, really did it. Oh, awesome. Okay, it says count all you've done. Do you remember the items that we found? Okay, we found the stethoscope, the tomato, the firefighter helmet, the letter A, and a ball pit ball. Will you count the items with me? <laughs> Great. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. And then it says, Go down the slide for some extra fun. Well, let's go down the slide. Come on. Yes, 
Now it's my turn to go down the slide. Will you count down with me? Okay, three, two, one. Woo! Whoa! <laughs> wow, that was so much fun. Hey, we figured everything out. We did it. We did it. We did it. Oh yeah, we did it. Let's go. High five. <laughs> nice job. Thank you so much for helping me with that matching game. We exercised our minds by figuring out which play center matches which item, and we exercise our bodies by running around this indoor playground. <laughs> that was a lot of fun, and thank you for learning with me. Well, that's the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Billy Bee's in Anaheim, California. My best friend Blippi has been here a few times and said it's so much fun. So I thought I would come here and see for myself. <laughs> I have my compass watch and my jam pack. So I'm ready for any kind of adventure. Come on. Oh. Ah, it's a note to me, dear Mika. <gasps> and it's from Blippi. Oh, <laughs> let's read it. I'm so excited that you are going to Billy Bee's. You're going to have an amazing time. I've put some things in your jam pack for you to play with throughout the day. You just have to figure out where to use them. Have fun. Oh, you put things in my jam pack? Let's see. Oh, there's a, hmm. <laughs> a chef's hat, okay. Carrot seeds, huh. And colorful ribbon, interesting. <laughs> I wonder what I'm gonna use these items for. Well, only one way to find out. Oh, cool, and Billy Bee's socks. Let's play. Honeycomb Village, <laughs> sounds fun, let's go. Oh, cool. <laughs> hey, look at this. A garden. Ooh, I love gardens because that means there's delicious fruits and vegetables here and I love to eat. All right, let's see what's in this garden. Ooh, corn on the cob. Mmm, delicious. Ooh, onions. Two onions. One, two. Yummy. Oh, do you know what these are? It's a root vegetable. That's right, potatoes. One, two. Oh, and I see a big potato right here. Yummy. Oh, this is getting me hungry. There's even strawberries in this garden. One, two. <laughs> Wait a second. Wasn't there something in my jam pack that belonged in a garden? Yeah, I think there was. Carrot seeds! Oh, this will go perfect in the garden. I can just, let's make some room, excuse me, food, excuse me, and put some carrot seeds in there. And you need nutritious soil, and some water, and some beautiful sunshine, and then a fruit or vegetable will grow. Ooh, I can't wait to see these carrots grow. <laughs> hmm. Maybe I'll take a snack for the road. Hmm. Maybe I'll find a yellow snack. Like a huh, banana. That's a nice, healthy fruit filled with potassium. Hmm. Let's go. <laughs> Did you ever notice that a banana kind of looks like a phone? Hello? Hello, Mika. Yeah, it's me, Mika. How are you? Good. What are you up oh, to? Oh, I didn't even know that this was charged up. Yeah, hi. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. I gotta go. I'm playing with my friends. Bye-bye. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> hey, I better finish eating this banana. Hmm. <laughs> Peeling and... Mmm. <laughs> Pretty good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm. Put the peel right here in the trash. Oh, and look, a 
It's like we're in a little house. <laughs> Welcome to my home. Let's see what we have here. <gasps> ice cream in the freezer. And there's two ice cream cones. One, two. One for me and one for you. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, and the refrigerator's on the bottom. I wonder if there's any treats in there. No treats. Looks like somebody needs to go grocery shopping. <laughs> oh, whoa. There's food over here. Look at these two baskets of food. Hmm, we should make something. What should we make? See a lot of bread and cheese and... Let's make a sandwich. Okay, let's see. What do we have? What do we have in this basket? We have bread. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We have burgers. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We have cheese. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And we have tomatoes, please. Let's stack it. Let's stack it. Come on, we're gonna snack it. <laughs> Check it out. Burger, cheese, tomato. Ooh, it's gonna be messy, but it's gonna be yummy. Mmm, <laughs> tasty. What else is in here? Oh, a really tiny soda. Oh, <sighs> nice and refreshed. <laughs> Whoa, look at this cool sink. Oh, looks like there's some dirty dishes here. Ooh, ooh, we really need to clean this spatula. So, oh, here's a sponge. Get a little soap on there and some water. Time to clean. <laughs> there we go. Hey, when you're playing, it's always best to clean up if you make a mess. <laughs> Whoa, okay, let's get some water on here and <gasps> good as new. So clean. <laughs> I wonder what else is here. Let's go. Whoa, a pizzeria. Let's go inside. <gasps> wow, look, pizza. Ooh, I love pizza so much. Hmm, isn't there something in my jam pack that belonged in a restaurant? Let's take a look. Oh yeah, a chef's hat. Okay, if I put it on, I can be a chef. Chef Mika, welcome to my pizzeria. Okay, let's see, we have the pizza ready. Let me get one of these trays here and let me just slide that on here. Ooh, good thing it's pretender. That would be really hot. <laughs> okay, let's put it together to make a nice circle for the pizza. Okay, who ordered the mushroom, tomato, cheese, and green sprinkle pizza? Oh, you? Oh, well, it's ready. Let's go to the register so you can pay. Okay. Let's see, you've got the cheese and the tomatoes and the mushrooms and the green sprinkles. I'm gonna give it to you for free. The sprinkles are on the house. Okay, that'll be one million dollars, please. Whoa, thank you. Okay, Whoop. there you go. And here's your change. <laughs> All right, here's your pizza. Enjoy. Actually, pizza sounds pretty good right now. And, oh, yes, I'm due for my lunch break. Okay. Whew. And that pizza special that you ordered looked really good. So I think I'm going to have the same thing. <gasps> and there's one ready for me right over there. Ah, oh, it looks so yummy. Hey, will you count the pizza slices with me? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, six yummy slices just for me. Ooh, then pizza's so fun because you can eat it with your hands. <laughs> All right, let's see, maybe I'll put some, a little pepper on there, just a little bit. And ooh, some salt. <laughs> Ooh, hot sauce. I love spicy food. Okay, actually. <laughs> oh, that looks really yummy. Okay, 
Here we go. It's too hot. It's too hot. Okay, I thought I could handle it. I cannot. That's okay. We'll just leave it there for a second. Maybe I'll come back to it when I'm feeling a little better. Let's see what else is here. Come on. Whoa, look at this really colorful place that we can play in. Come on. Ooh, these are fun steps. Look, the color green. And this step's the color blue. And this is the color green. And this is orange and blue and green. Hey, there's a slide over there. Will you meet me at the bottom? All right, see you soon. Oh, I can't wait to go down the slide. Three, two, one. Whoa! <laughs> that was really fast. Hey, there's something super colorful over there. <laughs> Let's go. Whoa, check out the rainbow slides. <gasps> that must be where I'm supposed to use the rainbow ribbon. <laughs> Did you see that? There's so many different colors. And it looks like there's a ribbon for each slide. <laughs> Guess I have to go down every single slide. Are you ready? I'll meet you at the bottom. See ya. Whoa! Blue! Light blue. <laughs> Here I come. Green. <laughs> Yellow. <laughs> Orange. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> Red. <laughs> hey, we did it. We figured out where to use the items that Flippy put in my jam pack. We got to plant carrot seeds. And oh, I wore the chef's hat when I made pizza in the pizzeria. And. The rainbow ribbons led us to these really cool rainbow slides. Oh, it was so much fun playing with you. Well, that's the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. <laughs> Mika. Well, I'll see you next time. Bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning fun! Mika, Mika, so much to learn about!